was, uh, you know, some conspiracy theories might hold a little bit of weight. Some are just really fucking stupid. I took it upon myself to find some of the really fucking stupid ones and share them with you. First off, I don't know if you knew this, but Michael Jackson is still alive. And he's actually his sister Latoya. People have been talking about this before he even died. Like, years before he died. But, uh, solid proof for this theory is that they look alike. And they have never been seen together in public. Ever. And wouldn't you be seen in public at least once with your own sister? Wait. No! And next, in case you want to wear, Michelle Obama totally has a dick. This has been proven by the people who valiantly examined her crotch and photos to out her as the man that she really is. That's not a joke. People actually did that. People made these. Apparently her physique is like a man's too, like her shoulders are wide, her face is masculine, so I guess by that logic, I'm transgender too? along with every other inverted triangle in the world. So we've determined that Michelle, or Michael Obama, along with every other inverted triangle in the world is definitely transgender. But has anyone ever suspected that Michelle might be Obama? Now, I don't know about you, but Lord is definitely 40. Or at least that's what some theorists, or as I like to call them, fucking gullible idiots, think. This was just proven pretty easily when someone shared her birth certificate, which obviously showed that she was born in 1996, but this wasn't enough proof. For some theorists. One of their arguments is that HowOld.net determined that Lord was over 40. And HowOld.net is of course a very reliable site. So I gave the site a go myself and it looks like not only am I transgender, I'm also double my age! I'm learning so much about myself today. Last one. Did you know that Jay-Z and Beyonce's kid Blue Ivy was named in tribute to the Illuminati? Can't figure out how? You must be slow, because Ivy is obviously an acronym for Illuminati's Very Youngest. So Blue Ivy's name is actually Blue Illuminati's Very Youngest, which I'm sure she'd love to be referred to as. Beyonce is the leader of the Illuminati, so it all makes sense. Probably could have done without the blue part though, or maybe, maybe it's all a cover-up. What's the opposite of blue? Red. What, what does red represent? The devil, or hell, or something. Something evil. They didn't stop at Blue Ivy, by the way. They also named their twins in tribute to the Illuminati. So there. So those were some of the stupidest pop culture conspiracy theories I could find. Now you can leave and go about your day with this new very important information that you've learned. But that's going to be the end of this video, so thank you guys very much for watching, and I will see you in my next one. Goodbye!